guys 10 ways to have the best summer ever. Lots of fun adventures. A lot. So we have some fun little like activities, things you can do, just like kind of 10 random ideas for fun things to do during the summer. So we also did a video on Lauren's channel. And so I'm doing three DIY bikinis that are inspired by like Forever 21 and Urban Outfitters and things that you can just do for way, way cheaper. That video will be linked in the down bar and also I'll have it linked on her face at the end. But for now, we're just gonna go ahead and get started. Hello, and I'm feeling fly. It's not with the so one of my favorite things to do during the summer is go on lunch dates with my friends and if you guys are like me, sometimes you get a little bit caught up in just laying in bed and watching Netflix and you don't end up hanging out with people that often. So lunch dates are definitely a really fun way to get hang out with your friends and eat super yummy food. Of course, we went to Nectar Juice Bar and got some acai bowls and they were so yummy and giant. We both were like, oh my gosh, we could never eat this whole thing. And then like three minutes later, we had eaten the entire thing. <laughs> It's also important to get active during the summer and there are so many fun things you can do besides going to the gym that are going to give you a workout. Like we went for a little mini run on the beach and we also played volleyball which was so much fun and I literally am the worst volleyball player in the history of the world. I was like shocked when I hit the ball over the net. Like I seriously am so bad at all sports and all things like physical but this was so much fun so we just played a little bit of volleyball and had a lot of fun together. Right here. We die and that's crystal clear We get it right every year and we We also turned our volleyball into a soccer ball for just a sec and then attempted some cartwheels on the beach and it did not go so well. Hey, we play it like our room is our life we Something I love doing like all the time is having picnics. I don't know why I think it's so fun to have a cute little picnic basket and take it anywhere. You can have it on the beach or like in the forest or something depending on where you live. But we just had a cute little picnic on the beach and just set up a couple little pillows and a cute towel. And it was kind of funny because we'd actually just eaten when we were filming this. So the only food that we had with us was cookies, but I think that's a pretty good picnic food. But we just got to hang out and talk and take cute Polaroid pics and eat cookies and it was a great time. love doing during the summer is going to a carnival. Lauren and I actually went to Santa Monica Pier and we just hung out there for a couple hours and we had so much fun and sometimes things like this can be kind of expensive but normally places like this will have like a day pass for like 20 bucks or something where you can just get like unlimited rides and stuff like that and I think 20 bucks is a pretty good deal for like a whole day of fun so you guys could totally go do something fun like this. We went on a ferris wheel and a roller coaster and of course we got some ice cream because ice cream is delicious and if you guys want to see the sad tragic incident that happened to Lauren's ice cream cone then you can watch our vlogs because they will be linked in the down bar another fun thing to do in the summer is to get a new summer outfit or a couple new pieces for summer and I know that not everybody has the money to go out and buy a full new wardrobe but you can totally go to places like Forever 21 and H&M and places that are really inexpensive and just get even one or two things like I put together this outfit from Forever 21 for less than $15 which is a really good deal and both the pieces are kind of simple so I can style them with a bunch of different things but having a couple new clothes for summer is always super fun. Watching the sunrise is totally on my summer bucket list this year and we were actually filming this at sunset. I wanted to wake up early enough for sunrise but we got to California super late so we just had to settle for the sunset but something about sunrise and sunset kind of just make you feel like at peace with yourself or like with your soul or something. Can't even describe it. If you've ever watched it you totally know what I mean but that is something that is definitely on my bucket list this year. If you are bored during the summer, you can do a DIY bikini and this is actually what Lauren's whole video is about. She DIY'd three different bikinis that are super cute. So I'm going to have that linked on the screen right now. You guys can click anywhere to watch it. But we had so much fun just like hanging out at the beach and I think her swimsuits turned out super cute. Also, this random Spanish club bouncer guy wanted to take a picture with us and he didn't speak English and it was kind of weird and random, but he was super nice so that was fun. 
if you guys want to try a different DIY, you could do this DIY smoothie cup. So you're going to need a pineapple, and all you need to do is just cut off the top, and then you're going to cut out the middle. And I recommend cutting in kind of like a diagonal circle so that you can pull out a cone like this. And then I'm just going to make a smoothie. I use banana, frozen berries, and almond milk. And for this DIY, you want to make a really thick smoothie so that it kind of sticks out on top of the pineapple and doesn't melt like mine. Mine was way too liquidy, and then I took it outside in like 80 degree heat, and it was just melting all over the place. But if you have a thick smoothie, then you shouldn't have a problem with this, but I think it's super cute for summer. You also got to decorate for summer, of course, and I just did a video on some summer DIYs, and I included some room decor stuff in there, and I think my next video is going to be a room decor video, but I'm going to link that video on the screen right now if you guys want to check it out. But you can find stuff for super inexpensive, like at the dollar store or at Michael's, like that's where I got that little garland thing, and it's super cute and really cheap for decorating, so definitely check out those stores if you want some inexpensive decor. And my last idea that you have to do during the summer is eat a giant snow cone. And this is one of my favorite treats. There's like snow cone shacks all over my town. I'm pretty sure they have them other places too. But if they don't, they have snow cone makers at Target that are like really inexpensive. Snow cones are super yummy and they totally are just like a summer essential. <laughs> you guys enjoyed it and maybe got some like summer inspiration so make sure you guys check out Lauren's video it'll be linked on her face right here and also <laughs> in the down bar and if you're here from my channel make sure to subscribe to Aspen's lovely channel so make sure you guys give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and if you like collabs we just decided our goal is 75,000 likes you guys can do it also make sure you subscribe to Lauren and we will see you guys well this is my video so I'll see you guys next time <laughs> but let us know if you guys would like to see us collab again